facts should be like in every situation, there are one or two facts and everything else is your perception of that situation. So you will be able to identify what is, uh, what is reality, which is something that sometimes you can change and sometimes you're not able to change, but reality is often really hard facts. You have no way that you can, I'm 38. That's it. Like you could be, that's good. You could be, say that's bad. It's like, that's 38. You're no longer 28. You're not 48, you're 38. It, that's, that's just a fact, all right? You have this many number of years left in your life. That's kind of a fact, right? But everything else is, is it enough to do what? Everything else is super subjective, right? So again, in every, every difficult situation, every problem that you face, remind yourself that what is really the reality? So these are the kind of things that I started to come up with. Um, not sure if it is really helpful. But. No, it is. And uh, I, I thank you for that. It, it, and uh, I, I think it's very interesting to see how uh, passionate you're even talking about it. Uh, it just proves that. I mean, for me, it really helps to see what would that principle do to me? You know, like the principle should be so much of me that it makes me so passionate. Yes. It, it just makes me talk about it and like really enjoy. And you, you made a really good signal that in the first one, that be curious. Um, you said that because it makes me happy. And I think that's, yes. that's very important at the end of the day, if, if we have our principles, if there are something that they're truly us, there's no way for us to not be happy. Even if at times we have to be struggling in a conversation, but we know at the end that principle is going to pay off. And this is I, like I, something which you're already running, like your software, like in your brain is already being curious, right? And probably when you're suffering is because you stopped being curious for some reason, because you're, you want to make your boss happy because you mm -hmm. want to meet a deadline, because there's something which has stopped you from your natural state of being, which is being curious. It's like, I need to know, I need to understand. And then that's just a reminder for yourself to be. This is like a cliche to say, be who you are, but know who you are and be you who are. I was like, I think the most cliche, way, but that's the answer to these questions are really important. And finding the answer is not really a rudimentary, right? Mm -hmm. I, if you ask me in two years, I might give you another answer, right? Because that's, <laughs> that's how, how it would probably evolve, like from where you're in your lifetime. Like, I don't know, if you're going through a tragedy, in your life, probably be curious is not the best mantra to live. <laughs> like, okay. Because that would be why me. That, that's like, <laughs> right? so you, you, then you have to adopt a different way, especially if you're, I don't know, when I'm, I don't know, 75, it's probably not be curious, but that's what my background says. And currently it's working. That's amazing. Or maybe and... not working and I just don't know it. <laughs> I think I think it's interesting, and the the time aspect that you mentioned is also very interesting. Like this this thing is gonna change because I'm gonna change. I think yeah. it it comes with me again. It's part of me, and it's it's something that helps me run today, but maybe not tomorrow. So I'm changing. That is gonna change. So I love that aspect, that kind of like dynamic aspect of it that you called out uh, rightfully. Uh, 